Hi, when you remember this female, she named Shana Chin. She was in or allegedly in a relationship with this handsome, young, respectful gentleman, Gullibab. Cargo, go suck your mama cargo. Very, very respectful. Gullibab ended the year by revealing that he had found true love with his new spouse. His new relationship has been met by heavy criticism online, with some persons pointing out that since the entertainer split with his first love, Shana Chin, his life and career have taken a turn for the worse. And while flattered by the comments about her having been Gullibab's source of strength, Shana Chin wants to be left out of the drama surrounding her ex as she heads into the new year. In an interview with the star, Chin revealed that it took some time for her to regroup and reposition herself in the entertainment industry after the nasty falling out between her and Bob. She also said that it is unfair that her name somehow gets involved in his drama every time he finds another flame which is another girl. Shana Chin says, I did something major for somebody in terms of picking them up and ensuring so them get a bus. A three years now since me and him left, I more strive and do my own thing. Me I do my own work and I get my life organized. And I just want people leave me out of the negativity. I try my best to stay away from the negativity and I don't want nobody to call my name in a mix up. Chin also noted that it was high time that Jamaicans knew the truth about her and Bob. So the DJ's ex fiance told the star that she and the body specialist <laughs> was never in a real relationship and stressed that all that transpired between them romantically was just for publicity. Me and him never have anything going like serious. We just projected it out there like that because that's what Jamaican people like. The gimmicks, it was all for publicity. I felt that he had a story where people would have loved to say, no matter where you're coming from and how you look, you can still bounce back and be something because miracles are my everyday. And it was working until what he wants to do with me, him could do. <laughs> Golly Bob, tired of the pretend pum pum, he wants real pum pum. She shared that all was well until Bob caught real feelings and wanted more than a business deal that he had initially agreed on. Me and Bob make a deal, say, when me help him get to a level, he would also help to benefit me and my talent. He was my source of bossing myself. We were doing things to make it look real. Like for example, living together. The plan backfired upon me because me never give Bob what he want. Bob did want to day with me and that wasn't a part of the arrangement. Him did start getting him feelings and forget say it was just for sure. And at that moment, she did have to knock him out with a padlock. For those who would say that Chin is looking to once again ride the wave of Bob's popularity as the DJ just recently emerged on the scene, she said this was not so. What popularity? I don't know what's going on with Bob. I'm not looking any female because the whole world has seen me already. I'm a female. Me can't die out. The whole reason why me even decide to say so much because people start calling my name again and start talking about things about me and me make him carry a stop. And all of these things. No man, I have to say something. <laughs> so people, let me know how you think. What do you think I lie Shana Chinatel tell? Say she and Gully Bob was never in a real relationship. They never did a do go do go. Them never they do none of them things they're together. Them just live together and I do it because of publicity stunt. No, the thing is me actually believe her, you know. Yeah, me like Shana Chin, but I believe her. Not because I like her. But pre this, remember when them just start to post videos on social media. Put on Facebook and them little site there. And if you were keeping up with the bops at that time, you would know say when them just start off them relationship and them all in the car and I drive up and down and talk the life on Facebook. Gullibab always a try kiss Shana Chin and Shana Chin always hesitant for kissing back. She will even give him a little chips on the jaw and them thing there. And the people them always a come and say, yo, suck out tongue, on a kiss, French kiss, re re re. And Shana Chin never wanna do it. Multiple times. Until it start to get to her. Now maybe them manager or somebody I say, yo, on a really have to go make it look real, you know. That's how them come and live and Shana Chin say. I want to talk about I don't want to kiss Gullibop. I want to know. And then Shana Chin give him a big kiss. Then everybody belly turn. People start to say, Jano, I wish my relationship did strong like Shana Chin's stomach. And be a people and make jokes about it. And from that, them just start to kiss regular. And I disgust be a people on the internet. But it was all for a good cause. Because Shana Chin actually get her name out there now. And I don't need to check out her music because she have the talent. As a female artist, you know the female artists them little bit in a Jamaica. So yeah, we want some more. You see, I wish she have the look too. Yeah, wanna go and check out her music, man. She tough. Paradise, gone in a dreamland.
Yeah, me say me gone in a dreamland paradise Gone in a dreamland As I may say, don't feel like I like Shana Chinatel Because she can be jealous, you know, if they were actually in a real relationship And she see all of the different girls them way much in Well, not really girls, more like old foot A old foot we call them, right? Yeah, him not really have no young girl like the girl upon the right <laughs> <laughs> but yeah man, that is just Gully Bop. Gully Bop no really have the fame like when him did have one time. Him have him hit song and him name the buzz and rare rare tete. Te. Shauna Chin admitted say yeah, she ride off a Gully Bop wave because she wanted to get that bus there. But she no want Gully Bop for bus her. She want bus herself using Gully Bop name because him at at the moment so Shana Chin is a opportunist and don't take that as a bad thing because Shana Chin did a help Gully Bob for uplift him career so she a bring up film career so that fair career can elevate to so she a think smart and you see if this is true where she has a Gully Bob and her never in a real relationship them never did a do go do go or them thing there I respect her, you know why? Because she no come out at uh, three years now, she and him left, you know, and she no come out and flap him show. Uh, because she uh, get tired of it and she done see say, him career sink and people already uh, blame her, say uh, she make him career sink because she left him. So she just assure uh, them now, say, yo, people, this is the truth. Me and him never there from day one. It was just all for the looks. For say, yeah, this ugly man of this pretty girl and them are going on the bag of things and people, them name a buzz on social media. That was the whole plan. Publicity stunt. And her doing this, exposing Bop like that, can't put a dent in him career because Golly Bop career already have a huge crack. It have a deep pot wall. So, she not try to put a dent in a Golly Bop career. She just tired of everything. So she have to tell the people them say, stop blaming me and me make him career fall. Me and him never there. And I left my left him man. You know some girl when them left a man, the man they pop down. Or some man when them left a girl, a girl they pop down. That's why each person will be independent. You understand? And that's what Shana Chin did aim for. That's why I say she is an opportunity. She aim for be independent, but she help someone else for them can help she back. But it just never works because Gully Bob they get all in him feelings. He must say your Jan will start every minute we go live at them time they alone may get for kiss that woman yeah. Every time we are, and good good the Gully Bob wanna go up on Facebook live seven days of the week, ten times a day because him just wanna get for kiss her and feel her up because that is the only time he <laughs> get for do that you know, don't follow me, you know. But one thing though, make me kinda have it say a lie she I tell. When she did bust Gullibop head with the padlock because Gullibop allegedly catch her with the next man in the house. How that come in? What that mean? No a relationship thing that. A real couples alone get jealous you know. Or uh, maybe. Uh, that's why Shana Chin did a call him madman in the video say him a mad, him a madman because she know say yeah. She have her man in the house and Gullibop don't need to be jealous because she and him don't in a one real relationship. Catch him a kind of debunk what I just said about. <laughs> it's confusing. That's why I want to know what my viewers and my subscribers think because the busted part kind of have me a way. You understand? When she has say a madman in be because she a wonder why him really I get jealous over that but she actually bust him head and I be a things or was that a publicity stunt too and maybe even this is a publicity stunt and then they'll get back together and start another publicity stunt and then they'll plan future publicity stunt for outdo the previous publicity stunts Illuminati confirmed and after each publicity stunt people get used to it and don't believe anything they want to say anymore and that at the time where shit are gonna get real you can't pretend forever right so people let me know what you think if you think say Shana Chin I tell the truth, say she and Gullibop never did in a relationship. As I must say, I kinda believe but the whole boss thing I confuse me. I make me know only thing Gullibop I got plan for say about this because you don't know say Gullibop now nah, not nah, do him not nah, write a nah, song, him not nah, get no nah, hits, him not nah, do not him just I go make a video about it, him I go up on Facebook live and talk about it. Probably this are because you know Gullibop now nah, have nothing good that come out of it already. So just make me know only thing Gullibop I go reply and say back to Shana Chin and how oh, she a go respond because as I'm telling you maybe this go on and on and on and on you know because I go live up on Shana Chin this and goodly I see the two of keeping up with the box this and then some other one of Gullibab exes I go jump in at yo I don't know it's going to be a bag of bag and a bag of pasta pasta but I know Gullibab is going to answer but yeah man we don't know the thing going on nothing nice like how bingo though man tough